real so good and it till the time ain't that Ospice in the trunk will make you do the margarina Look good, feel good. That's the key to life. Go down in the link in the description and get your merchandise today. Use code MVP10 for 10% off your order from today through August 2nd. We got fresh and fly gear, every single flavor, t-shirts, v-necks, hoodies, leggings for the ladies, Anything that you need is down in the link in the description. Shout out to all the MVPs. Roll to 10K. What's going on everybody? And welcome back to the channel. Hope everybody is having a blessed weekend so far. Shout out to the MVPs, man. We are getting 60 to 70 new subscribers every single day, and it's all thanks to you guys. We're gonna start off with the regular shout outs. Shout out to Robert Meyer. We're gonna do shout out to SJ Steelers Fan One. Shout out to Phonetic TV, another YouTuber that's been coming through and showing love. So take a moment, go check out his channel, tell him that Fat Dallas sent you. And then a last shout out to Alandro. Figuero. He's been first on a lot of videos, so shout out to him. We also got the MVP Elites. If you want to hit that join button down below and become an MVP Elite, we got Dexter Panita and we got Raymond Edwards. Today we're going to go over roster investments as far as who you should sell off in the next 48 hours and then who you should hold on for the long haul that has the best chance at going silver to gold or gold to diamond. Let's get into today's banger if you're looking for great gaming services head on over to ahmlb and make sure you use code fat for five percent off your order all right so we're going to go over two important things that you need to always be doing now you have investments for the past two weeks people that you probably forgot about now in real life if them people are not performing on a regular basis like every seven games they are at least getting five hits a couple rbis then those people that you got for very cheap at the last roster update you might want to cash them out and i'm going to show you exactly what i'm talking about we go to the inventory and you look at a dallas garcia he was somebody that I was picking up a lot of for about 1,003 to 1,007 stubs. So now, right now, you can sell them for 1,300 and then after the tax, you're going to make about 190 to 250 stub profit. So this is a person that I'm going to cash out on right after this video is done. I'm going to take them extra 44 to 50,000 stubs and then I'm going to utilize half of the 50,000 stubs until my better investments. So this Garcia, the Jared Washes is the same thing. You can wait another 24 to 48 hours to see if they rise up another 150 stubs because that would help your overall stub count in the long run. But let's get into the investments that you should be going after as far as holding for the diamond and then let's go over the investments that you should be getting ready to watch the price and cash out over the next 48 hours. He's a long term investor. He's very consistent. He should get a plus one or a plus two on the next roster update. That would take his price that's at 1790 right now. He will be hovering around 26 to 2700 stubs. So if you get him for 1152, you are going to be making a 14 to 1500 profit as soon as he gets his next upgrade, whether it's a plus plus one or a plus two and that will put him on the watch for diamond this anthony right here is another good investment on the giants i only have five of them but you can see right now he's at 685 sell off a lot of people were getting this car at in the 110 160 180 so you already making a 450 profit but if you wait another 48 hours and be patient he might go up to 780 800 range kind of like mike right here he's at 991 he's only eight or nine stubs away from the gold quick sell i only have two of them so you can go in right now if you want to get this card for a late investment you can go right now to the market and then you can go to buy sell now if you want to buy him you can look on the right hand side so you got 618 at the bottom 622 then 623 if you want to get 20 or 30 of these and you are late to the party put them in for 619 or 620 and then that will still get you 300 and something stubs per investment so moving over to the padres we have trent grisham and we have jake cronenworth now trent grisham 
over the past 10 games has seven hits. So I'm looking at him to get at about 22 to 2300 stubs for the buy now and then i would probably cash out and take my guaranteed 40 to 60 thousand stubs okay seven hits over the past 10 games is pretty decent but it's a lot of people that over the past 10 games have 12 13 and 14 hits so they are more on the radar so jake cronenworth has 10 hits over the past 10 games and he's batting a 281 over the entire season with 13 home runs so this is more of a long term don't expect for him to get a plus three on this roster update but only a thousand stubs you can get him for and in the next two roster updates that 1554 that you could sell him for will probably be 2554 2754 and then we are sitting at 12 13 1400 profit on each and every one of these cards that you get moving over to the rockies you know how i feel about the ryan mcmahon and he's been stepping his game up over the past 10 games he has 12 hits he has 16 home runs throughout the season and i'm looking to sell him at about 800 ish so if you've been investing in the ryan mcmahon's he's at right around 500 right now it goes between 500 and 530 if i can get him 750 800 i'm gonna cash out at least half of these because it's a chance he can get the plus two but sds might only give him a plus one Trevor story if you invested in him you want to cash out right now he's not been performing as good as Ryan McMahon he has about six or seven hits over the past 10 games not as consistent now we're not gonna make this video too long and draw now I'm not gonna give you every single investment that I have but this Giovanni Galagos you can see I have 58 of these he's still hovering around 3664 if you didn't invest in them you can still get them for a good price you can see 3061 and 3090 and 3091 down at the bottom okay so 3061 to 3090 you could put them in anywhere 3062 3065 anywhere in between there and you are still going to be making about 17 to 1800 profit if he goes diamond which he's in the 85 to 90 percent chance but this paul goldsmith you can still put in orders for him right now and they will come out on the roster update or after the roster update so if you were to put them in for 705 706 707 you still making 250 stubs on every single paul goldsmith investment if he gets that plus one which they might give him a plus two and put him up to an 81 overall that's how good he's been playing so on the pirates we have this adam fraser so if you've been investing in him and you have more than 25 of them if he gets up to about 2800 3000 stubs take half and cash out we also have this brian reynolds he's for the long haul he's had 13 hits over the past 10 games you can get him for 1200 stubs and you will guarantee to make at least a 2000 profit if he keeps up the momentum that he's had freddie peralta you can see right now i got 38 of them left i already cashed out about eight or nine of them so if you have 50 or more of the Freddy Peraltas and you see his buy now price go 4,800, 4,900, only 100 stubs away from the diamond quick sale, then you can cash out, I would say 10 or 15 if you got more than 30. If you got 30, cash out 10 of them. If you have 40 or more, cash out 15 of them because if he doesn't get the upgrade, you're going to go all the way back down to 2,000 stubs. So guarantee a little bit of your stubs in your pocket he's about 85 to 90 percent chance of going up i don't see why they wouldn't upgrade him but he's a good investment you're gonna make a lot of stubs off of him no matter what right here eversaw garcia is gonna be the last investment you can see he's almost priced up to a thousand stubs i got 12 of them but you can still do the same method that i showed you right here and you can buy them for 588 if you look down below they got 587 600 601 588 he might not come out in the next two days to you but right at the roster update or the day after he will appear in your binder and that's 350 plus stub profit on every single investment so the best thing on the lower cards that you have less of is to try to get 15 to 20 of them and then you want to try to get 30 or more of the big bangers if y'all enjoyed the video drop a like on the video if y'all rocking with me you know i got y'all also merchandise is live down below mvp 10 will give you 10 percent off your order let's go